R squared of the model with the mentioned limits is here is uh, may not be larger than R squared of the model without the mentioned, li mentioned limits. That is why uh, this R squared minus this R squared always equals zero or any positive value. If we assess how la large uh, the difference between this and this R squared, we may decide whether this variable may be treat, treated as categorical or interval or scale. Because if this R squared roughly equals this R squared, then uh, we may say that limits uh, on uh, differences between categories, any pair of categories of the variable are natural. In other words, in other words, model uh, without limitations, these limitations um, has R squared roughly uh, the same as R squared of the model with these limitations. That's why I decide that these limitations are natural for this variable. Thus, I may decide that this variable is a naturally interval or natural, naturally scale. Let's look at these couples of tables. For this variable, the difference between 2R squared equals th uh, 3%. For this variable, 88%. And for uh, this variable, 